Today we are creating glass stones. Here are the items you're going to need. So I used glue, Zyra Mega Runner, scissors, some glass stone covers, and foil paper, and decorative paper. Let's get started. To get the dotted texture, I used the Xyron Mega Runner. Sorry, I had it open. The easy fix, just open it up, rewind, like a cassette tape. So run it through the paper, wherever you want the foil to show up, and just place the foil, rub, peel off. That simple. Same technique with the glue, just place the glue, not a lot of it, just where you want the foil to show. So here I am placing the glue on the pink flower, where I want the foil to show. I'm also going to add it to a decorative paper, I really like the gold, so I'm just going to add it to the yellow, give it just a different texture. same process so I will be doing this throughout the video but just to show you glue place the foil and depending on what kind of texture you want either use the glue or the mega runner and um, I know with that with this foil from Xyron other adhesives also work so now I'm just trying to find the perfect placement for the paper. So I think I found my placement for those ones. I really like how this pink foil turned out on a flower. Probably my favorite one. So you just want to make sure you find the placement that you want ahead of time. Then you want to add the craft glue on the back side of the glass stone cover. I went ahead and covered the back side, the flat side completely. So I went ahead and gave it a little shake so the glue can spread out on the back, then place it where I want it. Same process for the other two. And then you just want to cut the paper down. Trim it down to as close as you can to the stone glass cover. Then you want to press it down to remove the bubbles. That's it, so they are ready to go. You can go ahead and make clips, ornament, or just decorations with this process.